Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to get a scene that kind of looks like this. If you've been into co-working, you know the benefits that it has, especially for anyone with ADHD or attention difficulties, or just people who need accountability to do their tasks. Body doubling is a very large thing within the ADHD community, and this can really help with a lot of people. So, first of all, we have a little game in the background of mine. Let me get my little girl doing something. We have a game that is on Steam called Spirit City Lo-Fi Sessions. I'll have it linked down in the description down below if you'd like it. It is a game where you can set your own tasks if you would like to do some kind of co-working without being in a stream or anything like that. This is a great game that you can use. You can customize your character, skin tone, hair, clothing, etc. and spirit companion. You can also have her doing different jobs around the place. Right now I have her riding at her desk with her little bird friend. But this is a really good game. It has a to-do list that you can check off, delete at the end of each day if you'd like, a timer for a pomo, habits that you would like to add, and it also has a journal down the bottom as well. Um, your active time and music. Now onto the task bot. So what I use and I found it quite difficult to find any kind of tutorials on this, which is why I'm making it now. If you head on over to the description down below, I'll have the Super Sweet Bot listed. Super Sweet Bot has multiple tiers that you can buy. This is the bot that I use. The owner will pop into your chat if you do purchase this. You will need a Discord account to set this up properly. If you don't, you're going to need to make one. Even if it's just for this and you don't tell anybody about it, you're just going to have to have one. We have the $2.50 a month, which includes the task list and promo timer. We also have the super sweet task list, info panels, etc. The info panels is very helpful for your community. I will say that this is the one that I do. It's a $3.50 per month. You will need to keep your subscription. This is not a one and done type subscription. This is a continual one to my knowledge because it does use a website per individual and you have to log in through Twitch. All right, once you have bought your subscription, you will see the super sweet home base. So it will prompt you to log in with Twitch after the owner of it goes into your Twitch stream and does all the stuff. You can set up the widgets. There is a full overlay setup, which includes the timer, the list, your tasks, etc. Just all set out already for you. Or you can do it individually if you only want to have a few of them or have them in a different orientation. Just fiddle with these how you like. And obviously they are a browser source for each one as well. They have different commands. It's very well set up. You can also download a little cheat sheet, which is right here. All commands. If anything is missing, it probably will be within their Discord as well. But that's pretty much it. Then feel free to move everything around. Make everything the way that you would like it to be. And you have your scene. This is the way that I like to set it up, but you can do it whichever way. Also within your timers, it does say this within the instructions, but if you would like to change the colors, of each task you can right click interact which is the third from the bottom and then you can change the color and transparency you can also flip the the panels around so that you have your tasks on the left and the other tasks on the right or hide one or the other you can do this for each and every single overlay that they give you you can also add your webcam or VTuber any way you like. Like I said, all of the ways to add tasks are on the cheat sheets and the command list. But a simple one is just exclamation mark task and then whatever you want to do. If it is for my own, you can also do now dishes. And that will make it the first on your own list, my tasks. Or you can do later and that will put it at the end. Of your list that is just an example of the things that you can do also you can change your task pretty quickly in your own one 
through task one or task two, task three, and so on, if you have already put them all out there. This is great for streamers in particular, but if you are not streaming, feel free to check out Spirit City Lo-Fi Sessions. It's not sponsored. I just like the game. <laughs> it's just very helpful. But I hope this is very helpful and useful for you. I do think it is worth the $3.50 or even $2.50 if you don't want everything. I hope you guys enjoy and I hope you guys get a lot of use out of this resource. I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys! <laughs>